Howdy folks, and welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4, playing Modded China with me, Scriptar. So, last time I gave you this lovely little tip, um, that you can just go into the... No, oh, it's that one, right? Resource overview, if um, you have too many units and you can't see how your battle lines are progressing, as you can see in Europe when you're zoomed out. No. <laughs> That's as bad as this, right? Doesn't really give you anything. Um, but it usually works, like, over here, where there's... The resources so that's good <laughs> we're pushing back into africa which is glorious Yugoslavia has capitulated so we're just mopping up here trying to get greece we can't get our forces out of what is this yeah sicily of course sicilia um these units are trapped all 24 of them because there's a naval presence here which we can't do anything about if we get the suez canal back we might be able to do so i guess i'm just not going to worry about them we could just disband them and, you know, get the equipment back. Hmm. You know what? Let's do that. Let's actually do that. Those tanks, it's a bit of a pity. They are very well equipped. There is no Malos here because they are in our control territory. They're not in circle or anything. We get everything back. That's fine. It's a little weird since the unit themselves can't get through there, but, well, this stuff can. It's okay. Awesome. So we're a little short on units now. It's not too bad. We don't need the entire West Front. Seriously, and when this is done, we don't need them. I will keep uh, the infantry and just have them do a border patrol along the coast, I guess, as we did up here. And then we just take the tanks and... Um, wreak havoc with them. So what are we going to do with you guys? Same thing. It was a pleasure, Mr. Kauhu. We don't need you anymore. All of them. Lead. They don't have any equipment anyway, so... Uh, all armies that won't have any divisions will be automatically removed. No, we will... Oh, those were actually not mine. They were Japanese. Right, we told them to give us troops. Aha! So you take care of your own people then. That's good. Alright, these are definitely ours. And the tanks are obviously ours. All of this is ours. So we have given them back their... Whatever it was they gave us. 140 units. Whatever we have left. I have just realized that we do have one single airfield over here. That we currently own. With 2,000 planes available. I have no idea if we can supply those planes, but if we can, that might give us the edge over here. And we could do strategic bombing. Do we have any air cover? No. 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 America? That's a dangerous game you're playing. Alright. Let's try this. Let's deploy... Our strategic bomber, where's the jet bomber? That's one, two... Don't we have the jet bomber yet? Oh, never mind. Um, nope. Bad. Guess we're stuck with bomber two. There you go. 120. We don't need that much. Hey, yeah, give me 100. Anybody still alive? <laughs> Uh, this is fighter and interceptor, so we have to wait until we find something in yellow, and there is nothing in yellow because we haven't used bombers that much. I can live with that. But we do have jet fighters, right? 4,000. Well, why not use them? You gonna do them in hundreds? I'll do them in two hundreds. I would usually just deploy them all and have like 1,900 in here. And then split them up later. Problem is, as, as long as they're deploying, you can't split them up. For whatever reason. So, we have to do it the long way. I guess they're pretty quick in redeploying fighters over here as soon as we start using our own. Just have to live with that. Actually, that's more than enough. We need some close air support. Do we have some? Bomber, bomber, bomber. Cas 3. Oh, that looks good. Go away. Go away!
Yeah. I think that might be it. So, which air zone do we need to worry about? Well, obviously this needs all the close air support we can get. Right in there. I still wish there was a button to set this. Like, you know, go here. Uh, half a row of buttons over here that sets that. And that's it. Would be easy, I think. But well, you can't have everything. It might be in the next patch, you never know. Sunflower patch is about to come out very, very soon. Yes, I know, that sounds weird, but that's what they called it. <laughs> so, how many fighters do we have? One, two, three. One, two, one, two. Well, I'm gonna take those two, put them over here, do air superiority. Then... Yes, southwest would be a good idea. Now, which one of you have been assigned? I hate it when it does that. It just says deploying, and you can't see it. That's you. That's you. So let's move up here. So it's everything that fits on screen right now. You go there. You and you. Go, well, if you can't go there, then you go over here. And these just stay here because we have 16 nukes. And we will have more. We're basically doing a nuke a month and we're gonna bomb the crap out of the US just because we can. Oh, let me actually give them a mission that might be a thing. Rain. Lagging rain should completely cover area 99%. Yeah, well. What can you do when you don't have airfields in that area because you don't control the area? But this should help a little bit, I hope. Still trying to push. It doesn't even look that bad. We just suspended a bunch of troops and this is set to high priority, so let's see what happens. What? <laughs> I can't even press play. Uh, Northern France, I don't give a crap, I think. Go away, go away, go away, go away. What are you? Naval combat. Finally, something? 173 versus 11? That's the ones we were looking for. Now, beat the crap out of them. Well, everybody's here. So many destroyers. We should be able to get some. Ah! <laughs> no. Um, all right, just let that run. There's nothing we can do. Something you can't really micromanage, I think. Hmm. Can all of you maybe... No, don't do that. Do this. That would be cool. You're just standing around doing nothing. You go in there. That's a lot of troops over here. Take all of these. Stop them from doing whatever it is they want to do in there and uh, you're gonna reinforce here take these guys and go straight over there that didn't work for these guys because they're getting attacked but eh. you need to stop this from coming any closer and go over there leaves you free Let's actually go in here and reinforce that maybe hopefully still have 70 watch the count Uh, and stop. So, why did I stop? Because I wanted to see if we have any more infos here. Don't like that. I don't like any of this. Not much we can do. We still might have to pull out there. Okay, let's see if we can actually wreck some face here. Those Angeles want to do this. What happened to our air superiority? Don't have any. Because it's night. <laughs> what? Should have a lot of air superiority here. Hello? Where's where's all our fighters? It says they are here. Still deploying. How much longer? 4th of November, 9 a.m. Well that's on five hours. Thank you. Now. That's better. There comes our close air support. So, can we? You have to get out of air mode to be able to drop a 
bomb from the air. Number one. Oh yeah, believe it. You're all gonna get it. That's why it's called strategic bombing. I'm just gonna bomb the crap out of everybody. Very strategically. Which means I'm just gonna bomb anything I can see. Like, you, why not? Also, can I? Can. Can I reach over here? Oh, that's, that's almost bad. Can't reach there. Can't reach there. Alright. One point. Ten points. Ten points is worth bombing. Ten points. Still have nine left. One point. Forget it. I can reach here. Another ten points. Ah, almost. Three, one, one. Not worth it. That shot hit their unity pretty hard. They are at 55. But it still won't help as long as they don't drop to 5% in this one city we hold over here. Frisco. <laughs> Would actually get them to capitulate. Not really much we can do, but let's watch that. Close enough? Oh yeah. Boom. So. 20. Oh, oh, that hurt, didn't it? Not at all. Well, you only have to get 20% of your points, and technically, since they are in a civil war, all of this territory doesn't count. We have to get over here. Ugh, alright. We're still getting pushed back, look at this. No, we need to do this. We need to be more aggressive. Hold everything, just go where you have to and push. Like, you. Why are you not pushing that back? Don't tell me you can't win that. Supply is not that bad. Come on. 82% strength. It's just organization. Total attrition 50%, supply status 40%. Yeah, I can get that, but at least you have your equipment, so just throw the tanks. Bad enough if you have to tell everybody how to fight the Americans. <laughs> now we're getting pushed. If we lose this, we can't bomb anymore. So let's do one more look around and see if there's anything left we can bomb. Well, it doesn't look good for Washington. Can't bomb this because we don't have coverage over here. Uh, would want to bomb uh, Vancouver, British Columbia, anyway. Much too nice over there. Right? You don't do that to Canada. See, this is the territory we should own. So, as long as we don't have the border over here and push east, which means get these points down here. That should actually lead them to capitulate, but we need to get there first. Okay. Did we sink some? One. 251 ships. Uh, okay. So all the real pros. Working with pros. Are we? Looks like it. Like you? Those 15 units? No? No. But since you're pushing there, we might be able to do this and cut them off. There's not even a port there. That might help. That actually seems to work if they don't file out, which there's no need to do so because they're winning their fight. Keep them busy a little bit longer. Yeah, you. Get that. I think that's how you do it. Keep them trapped. Are we getting this? Yes, we are getting this. So, can I take you? Have you go in here? I actually just want to assign you that front line, but then again, it's two different armies, so I can't really do that. Uh, what about here? Oh, that's looking good. 
you're going there? Where are you? Your tank, you're going over there. Hmm. Oh, probably because this divided up in multiple front lines and now they try to redeploy where it matters most. So, give me yours. Make them go in there. It's quite a bit of units. But we're actually winning that. Awesome. Back to here. Are we pushing? Can't tell. Doesn't look like we're pushing. No? That was weird. Hey, yeah, naval invasion. Western Balkans. Western Balkans? Really? I have armies here, you do know that, right? Alright. Well, whatever. Where was I? Uh, over here. <sighs> the last time I checked this was one troop, now it's two. We're still moving in there. Let's see what we can do. Push them back. Be Los Angeles. That. Five armies. Oh, we're winning this. Briefly. Gets reinforced. Yeah, I guess we have to pull back out here. Oh, that's too bad. Also, we're winning that. Uh, we're losing that. Reinforce that. Fast? Yes, forget it. Stop. Any more bombings that we would want to do? Even though it doesn't really matter, I guess. Why not have air cover? One strategic bomber in range. Where's your problem now? Did I lose all my bombers? Um... Oh, they reduced that airbase to rubble. Alright. Can't do this anymore. I have no idea what happened to those bombers. There's nothing here. Nothing here. Well, three guns. But they could not have shot us down. That's not a thing. Weird. Alright. Time to abandon plan. No use. Can't keep this up forever. Uh, we're gonna garrison you over here. Yeah, I know. I know it does that. That's exactly what I wanted to do. Um, come over here. Like this. Let me think of something else. So, H to hold them. Now they should file out. Mm hmm. Look at how fast they were sprawling. <sighs> what can you do? You're getting encircled. You're doing it wrong. And. Ooh. Just want to say, and dead. But managed. Hey, you're the last one alive. You should go now. <laughs> All of you. There it is. Go. Strategic retreat. Something got overrun. Everybody out! Mm -hmm, that seems to work. Damn it! Awesome. Great job. So, how many tanks do we have left on this front? 21. That should be more than enough to deal with that. Also, this front line isn't good enough anymore. Maybe I should select the right army. <laughs> I want that. All of you. Go. This is still encircled. That's very, very good. That's not what I did. I did control right click. Oh yeah, that is what I did. I selected them. Perfect. 24, so that's the tanks coming in there. Mm -hmm. Why is this two provinces? Who messed up? Alright, 
yeah, this is not working. Well, kind of. We have to keep these apart, which means we have to push in here, which we are. Perfect. Get on out. Need to hold that. Excavation three. So this will finish up on its own. There's nothing more we have to do here. Good. There's nothing more we have to do here. We could do some radar if nothing else pops up. We should finally get into this, right? Worked on. That's been worked on. Then we're done over here. We have close air support as heavy as we can get it. Naval bombers would also be a thing now. They could just deploy them around the coast and have them protect us. They're way overpowered anyway, so let's do that. Now we're back to 10 nukes. <laughs> could actually drop a nuke on Athens. 20% unity. I can change that really quick. What? Thessaloniki? Right, I thought German cities were hard to pronounce, at least for the non-Germans. Uh, that, that's a thing here. Nothing new. Any invasions I should worry about? There was one planned over here, right? Never happened. Was that you? Lead at least. Alright. Just continue. What about you? Axis. Unaligned. Oh yeah, you're the leader of the Axis. <laughs> that, that's... That was that thing. All of you don't want to join any wars, which is great. I'm gonna come back for you later. <laughs> as soon as I attack them, they're all gonna join the Allies. I don't want that. I want the Allies gone first. I can mop up efficiently and not deal with resistance. Speaking of which, you could all be deployed now. Go. Next. It should be deployed somewhere over here. Yeah, right there. And they're spreading out. Good. Yeah. Look at that. We have 30 free factories and they will all be like this. We're not doing a good thing here. Oh, well, the important stuff is on top. That's good. How are we looking? Oh, that's looking good. What? Olivia Isqueradista. I think. Uh-huh. Rebellion in the Americas. In both Central and South America, revolutionaries have taken arms and risen in rebellion in the name of democracy. That's stupid. They are generally well equipped or, no, and well organized. That would have been nice. Well equipped or well organized. No, doomed to fail there, either way. Uh, and if they had been championing another ideology, their funding would have been easy to trace. Whoever is supplying these movements, probably the US and the rest of the text doesn't matter. Nothing happening here? No pop-up? Nope. Have a look. Where is something happening here? There. Paraguay is Paraguay. Brazilian Socialist Republic. Wait a second. Our guys. You still don't want to, huh? Oh, in Civil War, actually. I would have thought that that might want you to... might make you want to join, and it would have given me a foothold to send my troops, and then, you know, just mop it up from the bottom. Oh well. So they've taken everything back. That's the thing. Might be losing some here. 69, we had 70. Wait, who was that? Jack Fletcher. Famous name if you know your history. Um, yeah, another one. <laughs> I just can't get over the efficiency there. This is looking good. This is looking awesome. Had that. So since we're doing this already, we might just go into this one. So which gives us the most bang for a buck or whatever that thing was the destruction that seems to be the thing we're doing but we do need battlefield support well tactical bombers which we don't have close air support we do have that fighter detection air support 
Support? Yeah, support. Ground support. Air superiority or ace generation. Air support. Those air support. Support. There's no ore in here, so you can have all three. Tactical bomber, strategic bombing. Nope, we need strategic bomber, strategic bombing. Ground support. Naval mission efficiency, that's a good thing. Bombing. Deception, alright. What about this? Fighter detection. Support. Deception. Naval mission, so we get that earlier, that's a good thing. Deception. Priority. Ability. Fighters, that's good. Air support. Now we have to decide. Strategic bombing. Strategic bombing. Bombing. Escort efficiency. That's a general plus 30%. That's a nighttime minus 50 and a plus 20%. I think that's better. At least we could go only nighttime then. I would still get that bonus. Well, this is standard bonus as well. It doesn't say daytime. Unless they skipped that part of information. Bomber defense is okay. Air support. Strategic bombing. This is all the same, just in a different order. These five seem to be the best so far, except there's no naval in here. Agility plus 20. Um, what was that? It's 10. Hmm. Naval mission, there you go. Port. Tactical bomber, strategic bombing, visibility. That's like detection chance or something? Hmm. This is more aces. There are some. There are some over here somewhere. Stupid? Yeah, don't answer that. No, don't, don't there. See? There! <laughs> Oh, what the heck, I'm gonna go for that. Alright, so we're pushing back into Africa, which is awesome. We hold the Suez Canal, which is even more awesome. Get in there. Go, get in there. Go, get in there. Um, or push. No, 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 no. There. You can do that. That one, which is pushing in there. 50. That one. In there. Thank you. <gasps> Peace. It's hard being a Master General. That's just what it is. So, we're pushing into Africa. Uh, we're almost won Greece, so we're done on the continent and we just lost the US. See you next time then. That's it for today, folks. If you liked the video, like the video. Subscribe for more. Leave a comment if you feel like it. Don't forget to enjoy yourselves. See you soon.